Hey Dory, I wanted to shoot a quick demo for you. This was one of the things we discussed yesterday with our new Gabby program where it's an ad revenue share. So what it does is it takes the white space in between jobs and you can actually capitalize on it by getting a quarter per job. So here I did is I print something and very minimal size window pops up in the corner, plays a brief little video, and then it shuts off after 10 seconds and your organization just earned a quarter. Now, based on your volumes, you do an average of 26,597 prints. So we average that a month at about 1,100 submitted jobs between copying and printing. So it pays out quarterly, but every month, you're gonna get a check back for $275, but again, quarterly, so you'll get that times three, which you'll get a check back for, I think, around $825 offsetting my costs. So what I wanna do is show you the actual video of the machine and the other kiosk. So this is the other revenue generator. When you come over here, well, it looks like it's rebooting right now, um, but essentially same thing that happened on the computer, you would make a copy. And when you made a copy, a 10 second ad would simply generate on the copier, okay? And this is the actual 50 page per minute version of the machine that you're getting. You're getting the faster one. Uh, but what I wanted to do was really show you the demo of the product because I know you have the Konica now. And we talked yesterday about some of the functionality and what makes this machine reliable. So what I wanna show you is Un unlike the Konica you have now, this machine is an LED print engine. So you're gonna see the actual print engine component is no longer in the belly of the machine. It's actually located on the left side of the machine. That's the fuser assembly. And this fuser no longer has to heat up to 400 degrees like typical laser because it's doing with LED lighting. This machine can print at room temperature and it can print double-sided at rated speeds. Here's another very, very key uh, factor here what makes this machine reliable. Toner are common wear and tear items, right? When these go, you have to put new ones in. When a drum or a fuser goes, you're down until a service technician comes. However, before a drum or a fuser goes, you have a lot of issues that happen, probably about 10,000 prints prior to them failing, right? And those are streaking, banding, increased jams. With this new engine, 